Now, have you been wondering who won the Nobel Prize this year? I'm Rachel Jones for Kalkine Media. Let's take a look. U.S. professors David Card, Joshua Angrix, and Guido Imbens were awarded this year's Nobel Prize for Economics. David Card is an economics professor at the University of California in Berkeley and has won the prize for his contribution to labor economics. At the same time, Joshua Angrix and Guido Imbens received the award for their contributions to the analysis of casual relationships. Now, David Codd was born in Canada in 1956. His research gave new insights into the effects of the labor market on education, wages, and immigration. His study challenges the conventional idea that more pay leads to fewer jobs. His study also shows that the negative effect of immigration has decreased significantly today compared to earlier times, and education played a critical role in professional success. On the other hand, Angrist and Imbens richly contributed to the analysis of casual relationships. Angrist, an Israeli-American, was born in Columbus in the U.S. in 1960. He's a professor at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology in Cambridge. Imbens, a Dutch-American, is a professor at Stanford University in Stanford, in California. He was born in Eidenhoven in the Netherlands in 1963. Now, their research was about how precise conclusions can be drawn from natural experiments relating to cause and effect. Their study has challenged conventional wisdom. The Nobel Prize is given every year for outstanding contributions in science, literature and peace. It was instituted in the memory of Swedish businessman Alfred Nobel. The Nobel Prize for Economics was not declared in Alfred Nobel's original will but it was instituted by the Swedish Central Bank in his memory, and it was earlier called the Fersages Riksbank Prize. The 2021 Nobel Prize winners of economics will share the prize money of 10 million Swedish crowns, or around 1.14 million US dollars. Card will receive one half of the prize money, while Angris and Imbens will share the other half. In a statement, the Nobel Committee said that their research provided a better understanding of the labor market and how a precise conclusion can be drawn from natural experiments. In 2020, Stanford University economists Paul R. Milgram and Robert B. Wilson had bagged the Nobel Prize in Economics for their work on auction theory and resource allocation. In 2019, Esther Dufflo, Abici Behenji, and Michael Kremner had jointly received the award for their research on poverty reduction. Now, if you like this video, please subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon for notifications for our latest videos. This is Rachel signing off for Kalkine Media.